Hello everyone. Yan. Bali tuloy lang natin itong places and landscapes in a changing world. Kung isipin nyo ang atake natin dito para maitindihan natin yung regional geography ay kailangan tayo ay magkaroon ng input pagdating sa theoretical framework para ma maintindihan natin kung bakit ba nagkakaroon ng changes particularly sa landscape. Kung kayo ay may handouts na, ito ay nasa ano naman eh nasa FB page naman natin. Aware naman kayo, no? Ano ba to? Yan. Yan. Edi, ito na. So, ang konsepto natin, para maidida natin itong subject na ito ay yung culture, way of living, or the first page lang i-discuss ko dito. Okay? Culture is everything. Culture is the sum of total, ha? total of knowledge, attitudes, and behavioral patterns shared and passed on by members of society or my shared consciousness. Culture yon. Characteristics of culture, it depends, ha? Kakaiba. Bakit nga ba? So, ito yung ano, patterns of behavior, ha? Ito yung classification niya. Common na sa atin yung artifact. Diba? Common na sa atin yung artifact. And... ay yung mismong materials or even yung mismong product out of human interventions. Social fact naman, ito yung way of doing ng mga tao, yung social structures, na nabanggit na dito, and, dic that, and dictate social behavior. ba? Diba? Even yung mga cultural observances, pasok yan, ano pa ba? Uh, uh, parol, ngayon, ba? Diba? Yan yung mga way of uh, interpreting the culture na kung ano yung pinagdadao sa atin ngayon, di ba? Ano pang ano ngayon? Yung culture ngayon, yung, yung pag-wear ng mask, actually face mask or face shield, nag establish tayo ng norm, di ba? So may changes yan, It, uh, kasi dynamic nga, di ba, ang social fact. Menti fact naman, the mental aspects of a culture. Ano ba yung mental aspect ng culture? It can it ito yung agreed uh, agreed uh, normality sa isang or sa, sa, sa culture. Ano ba ito? Uh, values, beliefs, social construct, yung social construct even yung acceptance ng time. Tandaan niyo yun ha, yung time. It is a social construct kasi una sa lahat, time is abstract. Kaya pag sinabing late ka sa klasing ito, o kaya late ka sa klase sa face-to-face, -face, or let's say dumating ka ng 5.30, ah, ibig sabihin, yung agreed time na 5.30, ay yung mag agree na uh, late ka. ba diba? So, mente fact yan. Agreed upon, ano pa, even yung, kasi abstract to eh, lahat naman eh, even yung race, race, yung gender, actually, gawa-gawa ng tao yan. Ha? Ibig sabihin, ay yung nagde-define. Uh, we made do, uh, those definitions. Next ay, how does culture develop? Okay, although maraming factors dyan. But to make it clear, i-discuss muna natin yung meaning ng landscapes. So yung landscapes na nakala nakalagay dito comprises the visible features of an area kaya nga pag sabi ng landscape iniisip ko agad nako mga taniman ka agad are dino drawing ko kaagad may bundok may bahay kubo sa tabi gano dino drawing ko as make 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 kalabaw no so yan including physical elements such as landforms living elements flora and fauna yung uh, species ng hayop at halaman abstract elements like lighting and weathering conditions and human elements like human activity and the built environment. Landscape siya, ha? Kahit yung gilid-gilid di yan, yan. Ha, yung mga iskinita, ang bahari ng landscape, pinakala nyo, puro may mga damuhan. Kala maganda ang scenery pag landscape, no? Sa atin ay hindi. Diba? Kahit yung subdivision, landscape yan. Yan, Senator Villard. Built environment, yan, ito na nga, nabanggit ko na nga, speaking of the devil and other relatively durable la cultural landscape artifacts. So, natural landscape, 
Of course, self-explanatory na yan, human activity. Without human activity or human intervention, di ba? Co uh, cultural landscapes, yan na, dito tayo magpo-focus. Are landscapes that reveals that many ways people modify, habi na bago, yung kanilang environment. Di ba? Cultural landscape displays tremendous variation. Ano yung kaibahan na yun? Pagdating kasi sa natural environment, ha? Ang natural environment, nandiyan na kasi yan eh. Ha? Namomodify lang siya o nababago lang siya through weathering, like erosion, di ba? And other uh, physical changes and manifestations. Pagdating naman sa cultural landscape, yan. May, may, ano dyan, may changes na yan. Dahil, gawa natin. So to speak. Next, environmental determinism. So, environmental determinism naman is the belief that the environment, or in short lang naman, environment determines our way of living. To make it quick para sa inyo, ha? At sabi nga sa ancient Greeks, ng ancient Greeks, ni na Hippocrates, civilization flourishes, flourishes only under certain climatic conditions. Di ba? Ay, example nito yung ano, yung fertile crescent, di ba? Mesopotamia Ano pa? Kaerisital naman Climate influences The political spirit of the people So may atake na ng politics no? Kung paano nag-come up sa gantong ideal Nakakapekto pala yun no? According kay Aristotle Pero postulate pa rin naman to lahat Kay Jean Buda naman Yung, yung, different, uh, yung attribution ng differences among people So differences in climate di ba? Pag northern zone daw Northern region daw Ah, mga, ah mga aring Uh, attribution ito sa tao ay ano, physically vigorous daw, but mentally slow people tending toward democratic government. Pag hot, pag hot south naman, parang bilaw na tayo dito, lazy people, intelligent but politically passive, and thus, satisfied to live under despotism. Ah, I-try ko lang yung kay Rizal, di ba? Kung sina, uh, uh, sinagot, uh, nirefute niya yung isa sa mga Uh, sinabi, nalimutan ko na kung ano saan siya, pero sin pinagtanggol ni Rizal na kung bakit ganto na uh, ganti yung way of living ng mga Pinoy tuwing tanghali kasi iniisip ng mga foreigner, particularly yung mga Spaniards, sa tamad ang tao lazy people, so nirefit yung ni Rizal, ba diba? yan kasi yung despot, despot naman is ah uh, Living by nature, kung ano man yung maari. Yung maaring you do believe in God, no? Or kung ano man yung prescribed norm sa isang landscape. Now, temperate zone naman. Optimal mixture, mixture of intelligence. An industry promoted the best government. No, I am not actually pinpointing that uh, kung alin man tayo dito, sa zone or sa temperate zone, kasi generalization ng lamang kasi ito eh. Tandaan nyo, it is a mere concept. Pag sinabi kasi yung concept, it, you can define it uh, uh, many ways and you can come up with a book with one concept. Ha? Tandaan nyo yan. Kasi ang concept, ang sorry, ang definition naman kasi, linguistically, may set of definition yan, operationally or conceptually. Pero pag konsepto yan, maaring o... Oh, maaring accepted notion siya, mental uh, association, o kaya schema na tinatawag. Kay Montague naman, he argued that rugged landscapes produce individualistic peoples, people, sorry, capable of developing democracies. Example ito ay yung Greece. Ang Greece kasi, sa, of course, uh, ancient Greece, rugged sila, kaya nagkaroon sila ng polis or city-state. Ibig sabihin, total naman, mahirap, mahirap yung traveling sa kanilang communication, nagkaroon sila ng representation. Kaya doon daw na, karoon ng birth ng, uh, ng democracy at nagiging strong yung ideal, uh, ideology na democracy. Whereas kay Arnold Toynbee naman, people need the challenge of the environment to put forth their best effort and to build a civilization. Or in short, kung ano yung binibigay ni environment, ha? kailangan ano, uh, it challenges us, people, kung paano tayo mag, ano, mag-a-adapt. Yun lang. Possibilism. Actually, 
to make it quick sa possibilism, kung ang environmental determinism eh, uh, maaring i-determine sa the way of living, sa possibilism naman, it may, ha? It may, culture, sorry, environment may possibly, ha? Uh, determine the way of living or pwedeng ano ha vice versa siya, ha vice verse maaring culture ha determines the landscape possibly kaya nga with such limitations ang nakalagay dito ayon rin kay Paul Vidal de la Vlanche so dun muna tayo ha ayoko kasi mag-exceed ng ano more than 10 minutes pero nag-exceed na pala ako yan kasi masyadong ano yung ice train natin at saka bago tayo mag-regurgitate ng napakaraming information. So, yan muna for the meantime. End tayo ng part 1. God bless. Hmm?